Super Mario Bros. is an iconic part of video game history, but it is very outdated in today's modern gaming landscape. We all know that video games need gritty, realistic graphics, military weapons, and death. Lots and lots of death. So today, we're going to remake Super Mario Bros. the way it was always intended to be, as an M-rated shooter game. This is about to be a huge mistake. As an expert game developer, you already know that I know exactly how to make a successful modern video game. These are the three ingredients to a modern gaming masterpiece. Realistic graphics. As you know, graphics are everything. Gameplay does not matter. A dark, joyless setting. Everyone hates joy. Everyone hates fun. People don't play video games to have fun. And finally, my favorite part, weapons and death. Lots, lots of death. So with this in mind, we are going to recreate Super Mario Bros. the way it should have been made in the first place. So for our realistic graphics, I went ahead and downloaded all of the models from the Super Mario games, everything that we will need to build our level. I'm gonna go ahead and download all of these models and put them into our project. Uh, we have the brick block, the brick block, other brick block. When it comes to realistic graphics, if we take a look at these models, they do not make the cut. These characters are cute, charming, colorful. We do not want that. We need dark, gritty, hyper-realistic enemies. Let's go ahead and throw those into Blender and work a bit of my 3D modeling magic. So, the first guys, I I know, I know how to use, I know how to use Blender. Look, I, I've been using Blender since, since the day I was born. Okay, and this, holy, oh my god. Wait, is this like, this looks kind of unusable. Let's just say this Goomba's gonna look very different. Edit mode. Yes! I'm a genius. Oh my gosh, I'm a genius. So right now, Goombas are not very realistic because they are way too short. In real life, Goombas are so much taller than they are in the game. So I feel like we need to make this guy a little bit taller. Okay, okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Tell me with this straight face that this Goomba isn't already 10 times more realistic. He obviously wouldn't be a Goomba without hands. Hands. Now we're getting somewhere. Let's go ahead and give our realistic Goomba some realistic human animations. This will not be cursed at all. Please don't look stupid. That's literally all I can ask is that this doesn't look absolutely stupid. Oh, what the heck happened to his arms? What? I kind of like the idea of it not having arms though. Bra ooh, a crawl. On second thought, I'll pass on that. Run, the zombie run? Yeah, I like it, I like it. And I haven't showed you guys yet. For our first person shooter, I have created a little first person shooter template where you can walk around, jump, just like Mario, right? But you can also shoot things. Guys, I love death. I love killing things. I'm such a gamer. And then you can win. And this will be the basis for our amazing recreation of Super Mario Bros. As you can tell, he's a little, um, a little messed up. So let's try and fix that. Make it brown. Maybe make his eyes white. Ooh, it looks kind of cool. His mouth red. This has to be ultra realistic. So I'm going to go ahead and add some ultra realistic textures to our Goomba. Oh, I, I know what to do. Realistic eyeball texture. This, this is what we need. Oh, there, there we go. There we go. Our Goomba is coming along greatly. He, we can give some realistic scale. Look how detailed and scaly this thing is. And now we have our Goomba. The new and improved Super Mario Bros. Goomba design. Amazing. Truly amazing. And now let's jump right into the next one. Guys, how do we make this Koopa more realistic? Extend the arms. Oh, what the frick? He has nice long arms now. I guess it means he has to be taller as well to kind of match that. Oh, give him feet instead of shoes? That's so true. Wait, in real life, he wouldn't be wearing shoes. Aha! Now he is more realistic. He has nice, really nice, actually, really nice, realistic feet. This is our new and improved Koopa Troopa. Please don't look stupid. Please don't look stupid. <laughs> oh, okay. I like it. I like it. Do we, do we do the same, the same animation? I think it's pretty fitting. Sheesh. He's actually busting a move right now. Okay, okay, okay. This is our new and improved Koopa. Troopa Troopa. Oh, and then of course, I almost forgot, but of course we need to update his eyeballs as well. <laughs> oh, that's, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. It's time to show off our enemies. We have our Goomba, 
not curse at all. Then we have our Koopa. Beautiful. This is the future of Super Mario Bros right in front of you. So with our realistic graphics out of the way, it's time to move on to our joyless setting. So what we're gonna do to start off is recreate the first level of Super Mario Bros in 3D. And then from there, we will add some very important updates and improvements. What we wanna do is use our realistic blocks to build out the level. And I'll put all of the bricks on the floor as one does. Now we have laid out the blocks for the levels, but does it work? Let's see. Please don't be broken. Let's see if you can walk across the brick blocks of Super Mario Bros. Okay, this is sick. This is so sick. We did it. We're, we're absolute geniuses. My, my, uh, my keyboards, it, gl it glitched out. My keyboard's a bit broken. So now we need to add in the details of our map, which are, there's, I guess there's actually a lot. And then we need to make a question block and then this brick, and I'll just do that for every everything in the entire game. It's fine, we can speed run this, speed run this. Uh, the final pipe is right here. Now, oh, this looks so sick. And let's see if our recreation works. Okay, so far so good. I can't get past. Oh! Did, did you see that parkour? That that was crazy. Wait, hold on. He definitely just can't jump high enough. Ooh, okay. I know what to do. Really quick, really quick. But I think when you shoot now, you should get boosted a little bit. Oh, yes, perfect. You can shoot yourself now. Oh, God. Aha! It's actually a banger mechanic. It's a little OP right now. Just slightly overpowered at the moment. As you can see, we have Super Mario Bros in the game, but this just doesn't cut it for the modern gaming space. It's way too colorful, way too bright. It just, it just looks way too good. So with our beautiful environment now complete, it is time to add our hyper-realistic enemies and make death. Okay, we'll start off by getting the Goomba working. He's absolutely beautiful. This is actually so cursed. What the heck? Is he moving towards me? Is he moving? Oh, what the? You can push him around. Sorry, buddy. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh. But as you can see, when we shoot, our Goomba doesn't die. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, God. And now, when we shoot the Goomba, it should die for good. <laughs> but what you might notice is that this is supposed to be an M-rated game. In an M-rated game, when you shoot an enemy, do you really think this is what happens? Not at all. We need to add a lot more death. Sorry, I just, I just really, I just really, I'm a big fan of death. It looks like they're like beefing. So, when you shoot the Goomba, he's not just going to disappear anymore. This is M-rated. So this Goomba is going to explode. This is the fun part. Let's take a look at what currently happens to our exploding Goomba. Pretty crazy, but we're not looking for a little explosion. We're looking for a massive M-rated explosion. And then with this exploding script, get ready, get ready, get ready. And now this Goomba's explosion will be much, much bigger. Now that explosion is absolutely massive. Oh no. That, that is beautiful. Now that our Goomba is finally finished after way, way too much time, let's go ahead and put a, put a, put a Goomba every, for every Goomba. Oh, oh. Okay, now it should actually work, finally. Oh. All right, it's time to put our Koopa explosion to the test. All right, we can see the Koopas in the distance. Let's see if I can snipe one from all the way back here. And if it works, then our game is very close to being finished. All right, let's shoot him, shoot him. My, my aim is so... Oh yeah, guys, the issue is that I'm stupid. Ah, okay, <laughs> okay, that was close. And now we have the Koopas. Oh, God. Why did I get jump scared? <laughs> that actually jump scared me so bad. It's about time we upgrade our puny little gun. I think this is fitting. I think this is very, very fitting for our game. I would say, <laughs> I would say it's a little, um, a little bit too big. <laughs> I love this so much. This is, this is absolutely, this is absolutely perfect. Let's give it some textures. Now let's test out our new gun in the game. 
this. This is amazing. 360? 360 no scope? Oh, 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 please, 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 please. Yes! I'm a pro. I'm a pro at this game. The very last thing we need to do is you need to be able to beat the game. Let's see if I can get a flagpole for the end of the level. <laughs> Should we just do the American flag at the end? To end our game, we have the American flag. And now, when you touch the flagpole, you should officially beat the game. Let's go. Absolutely beautiful ending to an absolutely beautiful game. With that, our M-rated Mario is complete. Truly the greatest Mario game of all time, but it's time to put it to the test and see if I think it really deserves this M-rated. All right, it is time to see if we can beat our amazing creation. So right away, we have um quite quite the weapon. A bit of an upgrade from like your typical fire flower. And then see, so you have this bleeding hyper-realistic Goomba that slowly chases you if you get too close to it. And if you shoot him, he absolutely explodes and you climb over these pipes. Okay, okay. Snipe him, snipe him, snipe him. Yes! Goodbye. Oh, whoa! Let's take out these Goombas. Boom, 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 boom. And now, the real challenge begins. Don't get too close to these. Oh, what the heck? What's going on? What's going on? Die. Please die. Please die. How am I not hitting them? Please. What is it doing? Why is it doing this? I need to run. I need to run. I need to run. I need to run. Run, 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 run. Run. Oh, no. I died. Now that we know what to do. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. All right. Let's take out this guy. Hey, bud. Oh, shoot. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Get him. Get him. Yes. We can go out here. Boom. Okay. That was kind of dumb. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Okay, I think it's over. All right, we got this. I'm a pro. I'm a pro. I've, I've played all the M-rated games. I've played all of the... I played Wordle. That's... Wordle, you know, is pretty intense. So, I got this under control. I'm gonna do a pro parkour move. Okay. Boom, boom. And now let's take out these guys before they even have a chance at getting to me. Boom. <laughs> Screw you, Koopa. Oh, God. No, no. <gasps> That was that was maybe a bit of a bit of karma. I climb these steps. God, I'm terrified. I'm terrified. God, they're so scary up close. Why are their heads so messed up? Can't kill them. Just kill them. We are so close. We might actually beat this game. This is it. Three, two, one. Wait, no, 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 no. Wait, that that doesn't count. Why did it? Why did that happen? 